Hello everyone, Prey Scooter here, and welcome back to more of Tears of the Kingdom. Last time we did the final fairy serenade and found a missing link. Let's continue to finish these missing links. Careful there, partner, you went you went scared away all the little birds away. It's too early to be so loud. You go storming around like that and it won't be just us birds, or just be birds and you sent fly for the hills. It's fine though, I did hear some interesting chirps and wobbles from them. Don't want to say it's too long, so I don't panic, but... Rumors are spreading about Princess Zelda that she's been seen riding some mysterious beast. Mm. It's said that to be a mountain of a beast too, one with huge, brutal tusks. Uh, my little reporters had never seen something so frightening. Of course, that made it far worse when, uh, far worse was that it seemed like the princess herself was controlling this terrifying creature. Mm. Uh, it's, I find it hard to believe that a beast like that could really be lurking in Hyrule. But if this terrifying monster exists, then the implications make th make this a very, very huge story. Mm. You know. There were guests at this stable t talking about some kind of rumor beast. My little bird informants told me that there have been a number of sightings in the subtropical region of the south. If we want to learn more, we should dive beak first into this stable with others. To see if the, uh, there are any of these rumors are true. I already went down there. I learned about them. They're Don Dons. <laughs> Hold on. You're saying you've seen the beast that Princess Elta was rumored to be riding on? Ha. Huh. A new species called Don Don. I suspect it would be some animal that no one had ever seen before. There's still something missing, though. It'd be a crime to put out the story in this state. Could I talk to that caretaker you heard the story from? I want to see this with my own two eyes. It's not a bad idea to get a second opinion on things. That's why editors exist. Anyway, let's meet at that site. Ah. I'm counting on you, partner. Stop, stop guiding me there. I made a mistake. You're guiding me towards this bloopy right here. I already know. So, I missed... It's, oh man, I miss, it's the one at the, at the tutorial stable that I was missing this whole time. We're doing, okay, we are doing the second to last of these princess sightings. Oh my god, I'm saying last so much, it's actually kind of freeing. You don't even want to begin to know how freeing this feels. And of course it's thunderstorming here. Well, let's go ahead. Uh, I would say let's head down before we get struck. But you know what? It's not going to be worth. It's not going to be worth the wait. Put it on. Put our goofy hat on. And get up on here. Also, I didn't point it out, but the the stable trotters are going to be at every single campsite now. Every single one for the rest of the game. I don't know if I can get across this rainstorm. I'm not going to lie. Let's do a little bit of awkward climbing to get up high enough to get close. Okay, that works out for me. Uh, hopefully it's be enough distance. I'm mashing A to get two and blow, blow me across. Oh boy! Hey, they left goodies. Ow! That didn't hurt. So yeah. You feed them some stuff, and you come, and you can leave. You come back, and they'll just poop out stuff. I got a ruby off one of them. Let's see. There's, <clears throat> let's see, some flint, some amber. I think there was this one in the back corner. More amber. So I'm not gonna do this with. Oh, let me get away from you. Is it safe? Nope. Well, there are these trees, so I think they're safe. I don't want to hurt them. That's the only thing. I just don't want to hurt them, the gentle giants. Are we done with the st thunderstorm? The boom boom pow? Baby jock in my style? <sighs> Whatever. So yeah, you can kind of see what happens. I guess it's really rare to get a diamond out of them, but you saw what can happen if you eat the luminous stone. Sometimes it's a boon. At least it's amber, so it's an equal trade on there. Sorry, sorry. Hey, ever since I was a child, but the Don Dons, they don't even flinch when the sound of thunder. They're on flatful. Oh. Ah! Settle. Oh, you saw me. I was expecting to run to anyone in the storm. Oh. This sanctuary of Don Dons. Yeah, yeah. We've already been over this before. Hey, oh. partner! Mm -hmm. Over here, big. Over here, big bird. You're big bird now. No longer pen. I need a drink. My throat is scratchy as heck. Ah, I see, I see. So it was one of the rare animals that 
here that Princess Zelda was here seen riding. <coughs> Help. And, in fact, the princess was also researching these creatures. Wow, wow rumors really can get out of hand, can't they? I mean, it's hardly a mountain of a beast. And all that talk of brutal tusks was just plain wrong. Such gentle creatures. That's why a good reporter just confirms the details before they go to print. You did a really good job, Hana. Hmm. We've worked up 11 ca uh, the chase of 11 of the stories related to Princess Zelda. There's never time for a break, you know. I better make t sure Tracy hears the details of what happened here. Go on and take this out to your nest egg, partner. Thanks. Ah. Tracy gave us another bonus. It sounds like this that article on Princess Zelda was a hit. Tracy is really excited about it. Anyway, here's the bonus. The job itself is rewarding, you do, you, of course. But there's a nice... There are nice, too. These are nice, too. Don't you agree? Really? Just gonna start piling on the money, sure. Ah. I'm gonna hurry back and get the real story published. You take care, partner. So long. Well, there's that old handle. And I guess now we're just gonna... I guess now we just head off to... Well, we're gonna head over here to handle... We're gonna head over here to handle the next side quest. Or side quests, because we're gonna do them kind of in tandem. So while we're here, the side quest we're gonna want to do is right back here. Lake of the Horse God. We're gonna go horsing around over here. Um, now, we're going to need our camera here in a second because we have to do, we're going to do two quests, one stone. I'm telling you, we're doing a shrine quest here as well with this. So, get your camera. And, like, I, if I didn't say it, I'm going to repeat myself. I want to make sure, uh, you want to make sure you get yourself over to this place up high or up on a high approach. Just because of the fact that we're going to wrangle ourselves yet another horse. But we also need to take a picture of said horse at the same time. So I think what I'll do is... Nope. Nope. I'm not here. I am not here. I am not here. I am not here. You can try and shoot me and kill me, kill me all you want. I have way too many hearts and I, and I have 60 armor. I will not die. So anyway. What we're going to do here. Now that we're up here. Okay. Hello, boys. Ow. Hold on, I'm gonna need you to perish for half a second if you don't mind. You bother me. Can you, you can't even get back up here. You know what, I'm not gonna. Yeah, bro, we went too far down. Okay, we're good, we're good to adventure again. So anyway, we're gonna capture a horse. If anyone remembers Breath of the Wild, it's actually gonna be kind of in the same vein of a horse that was also here. Oh, dang it, but first the Korok is gonna. Stop me. But anyway, there's a horse right there. That guy. This is going to be for a quest, and I don't remember if you can keep this horse once that all is said and done, either. But just, if, if you're going to get this Korok in the meantime, trave slightly, because this horse, despite its size, spooks really easily. Like, incredibly easily does it spook. But, oh, we're not done? Oh, come off of it. <laughs> but yeah, this horse does spook incredibly easily. But once we start getting it tamed, we'll be able to ride it over. We're going to ride it over to the stable, take a picture of it, turn it in, and then come back and grab, and grab the horse and go turn it in the shrine quest. Now, I'm trying to make a very subtle approach. Uh, get on it. I almost lo lost it. It's a big horse, so it's going to take a lot of work to soothe it. A lot of work to soothe it. Okay. So, this horse... No, no, no. Settle down. It's alright, big guy. This horse is kind of like the opposite of our, oddly enough, the big Ed horse that I got in our Breath of the Wild venture. That is actually in our stables as we speak. It doesn't have... I don't think it has a lot of... Uh, it doesn't have a lot of go, so to say. Yeah, it does not have any go. Settle down. I'll feed you an apple once we get to our destination, friend. Uh, let me go ahead and uh, highlight that quest while I'm thinking of it. Okay, whoa, 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 whoa. 
Settle down, settle down, settle down. This is the only kind of horse of its kind, I too, so, but yeah. This is almost a mirror of, actually, we'll test this out right here. Hold on. Can you, um, yeah, hold this thought. I'm not going to hurt you. I'll feed you an apple after I get this Korok handled. Uh, I don't like Holiday Proc, but uh, let's get the apples out. Oh, of course, after I come out of that menu. Of course it would function like that. I'm trying I'm trying to soothe a wild beast right now. Do you mind? Would you like this? Can you take it out of my hands? Or do I have to drop it? Good catch. Uh it's underneath It's underneath you. Oh you you care for me. Over here. Can you grab that? Can you grab that for food? Oh, big boy. All right. Thank you for your patience. Whoa, 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 whoa. Hey, hey. Whoa, you're going to go right into a hole. Settle down. Okay. <clears throat> I suppose I... Uh, oh, I want to get things. Hey, whoa, whoa. Man, you are temperamental. Jiminy. I feel like you could you could use some. I feel like you would eat a steak whole, but I don't know if that's even good enough for you. So anyway, let's go get a, let's go over to the stable and then we'll turn this in. But yeah, just like the big Ed, the big Ed we've got from Breath of the Wild, it's very similar fashion. Go over this way, please. Very similar fashion to that to that horse. It has it has a good top speed for for a horse. It is a very good and balanced top speed. It cannot dash. But because of its size, if it does run over anything and do damage to it, it will more than likely KO it unless it's like a black or a silver uh, type of creature. Okay, slow down. Okay, whoa, 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 whoa. Alright. Uh, I'm just gonna hop off here. Smile for the- I'm gonna need you to smile for the camera, big boy. Wow, that's actually like perfect lighting too. All right. Now you stay there while I go turn this in. Um, actually, I should probably talk to you from over here. Or do I just come up here to do it? Yeah, I do. Uh, can I turn this in to you quick? Yeah. Hello? Game? Oh, you had to walk over into position. Hate that. I thought the game crashed on me. Uh, just truly... Here, would you like to use this picture of him? Yeah, would you like to look outside? I actually parked right outside with this thing. Yeah, sure. Take a copy of it, plaster her up on the wall, have fun with it. <laughs> Another dream to add to the pile, eh? Just gonna be able to whip up production, and I'm quite good at this. How are you copying this, may I ask? That horse isn't gonna stand around forever. That's a nice picture. So I guess there is a photo of this in every single stable. I don't think I'm going to go through the effort to get every single one of these photos, but just to show that this here. Different one, just show me a new picture. To show me appreciate it, give you a pony point. And I can get a new reward. Can I turn it in right now? Ooh, the honey crepes. Oh, Link, looks like you saved enough uh Alright. Let's get our pony point, which is another horse, and then see what's beyond that, even though I'm pretty sure we don't have any more reason for get pony points. Hello. Hey. Such a car crash of, of events right now. I'm not gonna I won't lie. Uh three more points. Oh, nice saddle saddle and bridle. Cool. Oh where are you going? You can't go home. Hey hey you can't go home. Sorry. We have Dest we have a date with Destiny. Destiny, unfortunately, lives over here at this light blue mark. So, last shrine, let's go get it. So, we are now doing, we are, we kind of have done two quests at the same time, but this particular horse is, oh, da, 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 da. this particular horse belongs to a shrine quest where somebody has the shrine crystal, does have the uh, shrine crystal, da, 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 can, I can talk. Does have the uh, the shrine crystal available for the shrine, 
but he will not, and I do mean will not, give it to us unless we show him a large horse. This very horse we're riding right now. Now I'm pretty sure there's going to be something down there. I'm just going to mark this for some place to come back to in a second. Because I'm fairly certain there's probably a cave or something down there. Anyway, uh, you're at full gallop, so I can't really do much with you anymore. I just look out in the bay. You are going to... Okay, you are turning. Let me just look down see if I can see a cave. Nope, I don't. I didn't see a cave. But I, my, my radar didn't go off, so I guess I won't worry about it. Just chill, 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 chill. Oh, there's another assault here. Uh, I guess I'm going to come back to this. I guess there's a few things to come back here. I didn't know there was another uh, liberation assault there, but I guess it, there is. Anyway, end of the road, but we want to go up and behind it. I think there is... Oh, that's a very large tower too, actually. Yeah, but you can see the shrine from here. You can see the shrine from here in question that we need to worry about. And I think that smoke trail is where our dudes is. Now, I don't remember if we can just go across the mountain range on this horse or if we have to do some other way. I think we have to go across the, the mountain range to get up to him. Oh, come on. I'll call you Sandy. Sandy sounds like a good name for you, Sandy. Come on, Sandy. I believe in you. We can trot across this mountain range. It sucks, but you got, you have enough muscle. You got enough muscle for 12 people, actually. I know you don't like rain, but chill. Can we go faster, please? Sorry, I, do, I don't mean to rush you, but I am in a minor time limit. My own sanity is the time limit. All right, Sandy. This is our man right here. You can come to... What's the best look? How about this horse? That horse? That horse? It's even bigger than I imagined. The wily rumored giant stallion. A horse that's whiny to me in my dreams. There it is in the flesh. It's giant. It's a horse. It's a giant horse. Never felt so lucky to be alive. Thank you so much for introducing me to such a wonderful once-in-a-lifetime horse. How can I possibly thank you enough? What if I give you this nice shiny crystal? Picked up when I, I saw passing through. Oh, I was thinking about using it to deck out my horse to make it the best looking beast that the world's ever seen. But when I saw a giant stallion you showed me, I realized I'd be a fool. There's no proving on a horse. Any horse. That, they're perfect to begin with. So I won't need the crystal. You can do whatever you want with it. Thanks. You can even have the horse. I don't want it. I don't like horses. I will sooner build a machine than ride a horse in this game. And I don't ride horses to begin with. So imagine how... So imagine how... Sorry. Sorry, Sandy. So imagine how little I will use that horse if I to keep it. Anyway, that's the Shrine Quest all handled. Lily, the guy wants to see that horse. The stable wants a picture of that horse. Everyone wants that horse. Stop horsing around. I know it's because I'm literally walking into it. I'm just going to go ahead and uh, delete this. Zoom up the map a little bit too, Jesus. I think there is a cave... I think there actually is a cave right below this shrine too, so we might have a little side, uh, a little side adventure here in a second to go into the cave just below the cliff here. There's, a, I can, I can find out, I can find out real fast. Oh, it counts as his own creature. Neat. Really, nothing. I figured there was a, I figured there was going to be a, uh, yeah, I figured there, there was going to be. A cave right around here. But I guess not. Alright, let me in. Let me in, let me in, let me in, let me in! And because we did this, uh, because we did the whole thing with the horse, we just get this for free. So I guess the fake out train I'm thinking about is, it's either in the sky, or it's in the Gerudo region. Weird. Anyway. Hello, I would like my free light of blessing now, please. Please, 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 I beg you. Thank you, I appreciate it. Man, I should go turn these in so I can get two more hearts. It's only two hearts, but it's something. Well, now that I'm on this track, I guess I'm, uh, I almost feel like I want to take a moment. Man, I feel like I get actually a lot of, 
some kind of reward for finishing that up, but... Or maybe that's what that party is doing out there on the, near that boat, is they're actually staging an assault on this tower just behind us. But... Um... I almost want to, uh... <clears throat> excuse me. I almost want to, like, start going to this various Sakura trees and start plot, uh, putting plots of things down just to see if my theories are correct on what they're used for. Anyway, uh, oh. Not this one. Let's help Addison before we move on. I'm literally just gonna make a very simple two stake. I could... No, not that. That can stay where it is. I want this. I'm just gonna make a very simple two stake platform to... Hold this in place. I think this is all we need. It's about the right height. Oh, get on the ground, please. Get on the ground, please. It's about the right height. It's about the right width. I'm going to make sure that it has the... Uh... Let's try that again. No, not you. You... Ah, uh, good enough. Um, hopefully it'll hold how, I, how I'm envisioning it. Well, let's just hope that'll hold. Try letting go. Ah, perfect. Like a glove, even. Alright. Well, Addison, I actually came to help the Liberation Force because I passed by it, but uh, yeah, I guess you'd be a nice second place. As we bid farewell to Sandy, I'm going to end the episode here. Everyone, thank you all so much for watching, and I hope to see you next time. Take care.